According to reports, TJ, home steamy PDA with Amy Robach could hurt him in the custody case. He needs to be more private. At the tail end of 2022, the TJ, Holmes and Amy Robach scandal that rocked Good Morning America is still going on. The co-anchors of GMA3 reportedly feel they have nothing to hide now that their relationship is public and even after spending the holidays together, but many divorce attorneys don't share that opinion and have suggested that it could actually make things worse for Holmes, 45, while going through divorce proceedings with his soon-to-be ex-wife, Marilee Feebig, also 45, especially in regards to their custody dispute. Daughter Sabine, age 9, is the child of Holmes and Feebig, who have been married for 12 years. Holmes also has children, Brianna and Jaden, with his ex-wife Amy Furson. Although it's unclear at this point if the now-divorced couple wants full custody of their daughter, or joint custody, we do know that Holmes and Robox PDA may prevent him from receiving the parenting arrangement he wants. Holmes is apparently going to be represented in court by Robert H. Moses, who was voted New York City's Lawyer of the Year and Best Lawyer's 2023 Family Law Edition. Moses is now keeping quiet regarding his client's divorce, but other attorneys have spoken to the media about their own perspectives on the situation. And based on what we've seen thus far, Holmes doesn't appear to be helping himself at all. The managing partner of the New York family law firm Miller Ziderman, Lisa Ziderman, said people that Holmes given the ongoing divorce proceedings should be more private. She continued, adding, I think there are less public ways to handle it. If this were my client, I would advise them to keep their situation private if it is something they must, want to, or need to do right now. And by all means, refrain from making it public yourself. Insiders stated that Holmes and Robach had actually dissolved their relationships with their respective husbands in August after their affair was made public in November, and didn't start dating till after that. Phoebe felt absolutely blindsided when she learnt of the affair because it was later established that she and Holmes wanted to try again at marriage, which is why he was still wearing his wedding band. After that, they both felt very at ease dating in public because they were separated. Even their spouses had relocated. Therefore, they had nothing to hide, a source told People. They spent the holidays together and are spending all of their time together right now, their insider continued, adding that Holmes and Robach are in love and engaged in a committed relationship. They are committed to their connection. They have no need to conceal anything, therefore they don't. Ziderman contends that there is a cause to, and that reason is Holmes' custody dispute. Ziderman stated, When we have customers who are having affairs, we encourage them to be extra careful about not flaunting it, about being careful because you don't really want your children to read this in the newspaper, because your youngster will see everything. That doesn't really help, and it's probably not a good idea to do this. You need to be able to put your child's best interests before your own in a divorce proceeding. Ziderman continued, While it is entirely lawful for you to date after, the issue is not merely one of what is legal. The best course of action for your child must be considered. Holmes' attorney may not have spoken to us yet, but Phoebe's legal counsel has already made a formal statement on Holmes' conduct this year. According to the Daily Mail, Phoebe's lawyer Stephanie Lehman said in a statement on January 4 that notwithstanding, we continue to be disappointed by T.J.'s lack of discretion, respect, and sensitivity toward Marilee and the party's daughter. To that end, T.J.'s attorney and I have been collaborating to forward their divorce as swiftly, confidentially, and amicably as possible. Phoebe's lawyer said that she is moved by the outpouring of support from fans and that their daughter is her primary concern.